My name is Scott Reid. I work for Macro Construction. The project I'm going to be talking about today is called the Dunsmore House. It's a two-bedroom house in Stittenham or Dross near Inverness. It was designed and built by Macro. Macro is committed to natural construction and reducing the impact of the building upon the environment. When designing the Dunsmore House, there was an opportunity to, to look at using timber uh, ground beams as opposed to traditional concrete foundations. Concrete uses Portland cement, which is high in embodied energy and carbon. In addition, using pier foundations allows the, the building to sit slightly on the land uh, above the terrain and not obstructing the, the drainage which can flow underneath the, the building. Uh, it's also more responsive uh, to its environment. Access Technologies has a product called Akoya Timber, a modified timber process that increases wood preservation and durability. Through an acetylation process, the sustainably sourced softwood timber, a hydroscopic material, is changed by exposure to acidic acid, rendering the wood dimensionally stable and durable. The Dunsmore House therefore uses acetylated timber ground beams with a floating floor cassettes, all resting upon concrete piers. This essentially removes the need for continuous strip footings. The floor cassettes, wall and roof panels were all pre-assembled in our workshop facility and then rapidly installed on site within a few days. We have been working with Napier University Centre of Offsite Construction and Innovative Structures to evaluate the viability of acetylated glue laminated ground beams. The university group has monitored the beam with strain gauges to evaluate settling over time. The preliminary results demonstrate good performance of the beams with virtually no movement. By using timber ground beams instead of strip foundations, the Dunsmore House saves approximately 2,000 kilograms of carbon equivalent. In more tangible terms, a single family house in the UK consumes on average 10,102 kilograms of carbon equivalent annually. Therefore, the savings by virtue of timber ground beams would provide heating for an average sized house for three months. For an energy efficient house, such as the Dunsmore House, this savings in carbon would provide heat for up to 12 months. In more day-to-day -day terms, this savings is the same as taking a car off the road for one year. This does not seem like much, however, taken across the whole of the UK for new built homes per annum, replacing strip foundations with ground beams saves the amount of carbon produced each year by 8,422 cars. This represents significant environmental benefits by virtue of modified timber ground beams.